veterans here with us Correct. today. Thank you so much for being here. We have Richard and we have Mark. Right. And you have a big rally coming up yeah, uh, next, on Saturday already, isn't Saturday, it? Saturday, yep. Yeah, so what do we need to know about the rally? The rally is about, uh, everybody knows about post-traumatic stress. Yeah. Not just veterans get it. Uh, veterans, their families, police department, fire department, anybody can get post-traumatic stress. But we're having a rally this this uh, Saturday, yeah. Saturday, I'm sorry. Excuse me, a little touching no, for me. Okay. I usually do the PTSD rides in the summer sure, for okay. Legion, so. And it starts at 10 o'clock tomorrow. It starts at 10 o'clock tomorrow. We're gonna have uh, Legionnaire, our VSO, Sh Jennifer Schumacher, who had started this program about 13 years ago. Okay. And it's a PTSD support group. She tried it, she used it to get her master's in. It's been going pretty good. It's a free to families and members of the Legion and anybody who's got PTSD okay. needs to talk to the support group. Meets on the 24th of each month. The rally is about uh, post-traumatic stress and uh, the mis misconceptions of it sure. and the myths of it. Uh, we're going to have uh, Jennifer Schumacher talk about her class or course that she's got. Okay. Uh, it's free to veterans. Freeze. Yeah. Not just for veterans, but anybody who has thinks they have a problem with post-traumatic stress needs okay. somebody to go. It's for the civilians as well. I mean, sure. well uh, and again, this is in Yoda, this, right? That one is in uh, VFW in okay. American, uh, oh. right here in Rochester. Right here in Rochester, okay. So that's okay. on the 24th, uh, the fourth Thursday of every month. Is okay. That. Then we have uh, a friend of hers, I uh, forgot, Dr. <laughs> Trista. She's got uh, aroma therapy, which works with uh, uh, smells and oils and stuff, oh. which is good. And then we got Dr. Lansing, who's been a desert, uh, Vietnam veteran with post traumatic stress. His, his mo is the most speaker or he's the last speaker of the day. He's also has studied, you know, PTSD is his major thing. He helped start the vet court down here in Rochester, or in Southeast Minnesota. So, you know, the American Legion has been really big with post-traumatic stress and the veterans and their families and communities. Sure. And, and Mark, you've served our country. I served our when country. When did you serve? I served back in uh, 1986 to 90. 90, 92. Okay. 1992. Okay. I was a Desert Storm veteran. I was in the Battle of Albasai and also Medina Ridge in Iraq. Thank you so much for your and service. And then uh, also, too, everybody has a misconception about the American Legion. The American Legion, you serve 24 hours. Just 24 hours, you got a DT 14, you can join the American Legion. Okay. And there's 57 Legion posts in southeast Minnesota that welcome to join anybody who would like sure. to join. And we have two of them in Rochester. We got post 446, which meets at the VFW, and we have post 92 that's in Southern Town down here. Uh, if you feel like you need a place to join, join the American Legion. We're here. We're not, we're not the old uh, Grandpa's American Legion, but some parts we are. You need a place to talk about PTSD or just to talk, connect. We're here. Uh, we got another program we're running this year. Is be the one. If you see somebody that, I'm, I'm, I'm rambling, but if you be the one, it's if you see somebody just sitting by themselves or look lonely, something like that, say, hey, how you doing? How you doing? You never know. Maybe that'd be the one that saves lives. And if you do need somebody to call, call the new 988 number and hit right. one. Yeah. Also, right. we also, uh, we also in the state of Minnesota are losing 100 veterans. And we're also working with Believe Vets where they're building a building where they can uh, facilitate 100 dogs to help combat the 100 suicide deaths. Okay. So if anybody wants to come down and, you know, see what we're all about and come to the rally, and we call it a rally, basically it's like a meeting, uh, what's going on in the community, and that's one of our pillars is our community and family. Absolutely. Doing a lot of good. Thank and you we so try much to. for being here, Mark. We appreciate we, you sharing more about what's to come here on uh, Saturday. Saturday, and we also have PTSD rides during the summer. So sure. I've been yeah. interviewed a couple times from you guys, and yeah. well, it's a great time. Yeah, well, thank you so much, Mark. We appreciate thank you. it. And Richard, thanks for being here, being thank his you. support. And you're with Olmstead County, too, right? Yes, I'm the Olmstead County Commander. And uh, I was going to say that if any veteran is sick, uh, physically, mentally, call, call on your county service officer. They are in the health department on the second floor. Uh, call up, get an appointment, get it, get taken care of. They will help you. Richard, thank you and so any, much. Uh, and any veterans that are going to be scammed, you do not charge to be evaluated. You go down to Olmstead County service officers, they'll do all the paperwork for you. Yeah, that's some. That's a good reminder. Thank you yeah. so much.
Helen to bring their DD-214 form, <laughs> just in case that they're not on the computer. Okay. Yeah. All right. Some good tips. Thank you two so much for being here, and thanks for sharing thanks for having us. the rally. Thank it's you. coming up on Saturday in Iota. We have details again on our website, KTTC. We have more to come on Midwest Access, including a look at weather. And we also have a comedy show to tell you about. But we, as we had to break, we're going to remind you of our question of the day.